yeah, you know what time it is. All the way from the legendary Russell Industrial Center in the heart of Detroit City comes Hyped Up Live Sessions. The show to bring the very best talent from Detroit, from around the world, to you sitting on your couch. Yeah, with your host, your boy T Money Green. You bound to see some hell of a talent, baby, for sure. Couch concerts coming up. You could be the next artist to perform on the Hyped Up Live stage. Yeah, you know me, or if you don't know, check it out. From the dramatics to George Clinton to Snoop Dogg, my resume speaks for itself. If I said I'm bringing you the very best, I'm bringing you the very best in entertainment. Hyped Up Live session, the way we wish you would experience Detroit music. Tonight's show is sponsored by Strauss and Strauss, Michigan's finest attorneys at law. Ooh Wee Coffee, it's organic. Mike Zolchek, any five, available on iTunes and Spotify. Podcast Detroit, Detroit's finest podcast hub. Herbacare Dispensary, 8680, 8 Mile in Van Dyke. House of Pancakes, the very best in Macomb County. The Digital Vision. Fat Roach Records. And from the makers of Dope Water, what's your dope ass dream? This month's single spotlight Red Rum Society, How I Cope. Available on all media outlets. Yeah! Episode 16 is in the building. Let's hear it! Oh, yeah, it's getting better and better. And I'm feeling full with this dope. This, as long as you keep the dope coming, the dope, I can, I can uh, do this thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But right now, look. Hey, look, this is 16 episodes, right? Yeah. Well, let me hear it, man. Y'all ain't too geeked up. Because we got a hell of a superstar here today for us. Yes, episode 16 brought about a star. And I like to uh, hand the stage over to Miss Gina. Irene Ashuto. Yeah. Thank you. Hi, my name is Gina. Um, I'm originally from Farmington Hills, Michigan, but uh, I hang around Detroit, and I'm very proud to be uh, from this music community. So thank you for having me. I'm gonna play a few of my, playing a few of my originals and a few covers too. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And hi to everybody at home too. The first song. I'm gonna perform is uh, definitely on my first album, Cold Fame, and it's called So I Get High. Yeah! Because I love to. I called the other day to talk about the one good thing. Makes me feel better, only there's a doubt I'll be the stronger when you're not around And keep me going on just so I don't break down I know it takes so long to get comfortable But I'm bored The scene don't change, but I can't run away And change my name, so I Invincible, but I'm right about this one good thing. 
can probably hear it too at home. She's a good supporter. Um, all right, cool. So a lot of these songs are written from personal experience because that's what I always thrive off of when I'm trying to gain inspiration. Um, this next song is called Floating Down the River. I wrote it about, pretty much about moving out of my house and more towards downtown, which I'm in an arbor right now, but I think I'm going to definitely move more towards downtown this summer, so I'm very excited about it. So this is called Floating Down the River. Oh 
Thanks, y'all. How you feeling tonight, audience? You feeling good? I'm sure everyone's feeling good at home and snuggled up in their PJs. Oh, yeah. So, what day is it today? Is it when? Tuesday? Tuesday? It is Tuesday. Oh, yeah. All right. So, this next song uh, is a cover. I haven't put it out yet. I have a recorded version of it. I do need to put it out because I love it. Um, and it's by Simon and Garfunkel. Uh, so, it's called America, which I feel is very suiting for right now. <laughs> Right. Again, thank you so much for having me. This is so cool. This room is amazing. Thank you, yeah, of course.
Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah. I don't usually play that one live a lot because there's a lot of chords. There's a lot of chords in that one. So I really had to practice on that one. I'm glad I didn't mess up. So thanks for listening, y'all. All right. So the next one. Um, I think it's one of my favorites that I've written. I like to say that. Um, it's called Black Magic. And I think... I think uh, the inspiration of this song is like just being the oddball of your family, pretty much. Um, even though my family's so supportive, there's only like my brother that loves music, musical theater, and is you know into music. So, like I am. So, it feels uh, it feels good to be the oddball at times. Woo! All right, this is called Black Magic. Yeah, you're in this one too. <laughs> Sleep until the afternoon Out of tune with reality I wake up when the sun goes down When I find clarity Mother thinks I'm lazy
dope. <laughs> so dope. So dope. This is awesome. I can't wait to drink this all the time. Um, hell yeah. Um, so this next one is pro- no, it's one of two love songs on my first album. I wasn't too much into love um, at the time of writing my first album, but um, I did meet somebody, and um, the song's about him. And fortunately, we're still together, so it's great. <laughs> So, uh, cool. It's called Animal Mind. song always makes me blush, though, when I play it, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's hot in here. Wow. Well, um, so this next one I just learned, like, a few weeks ago, actually. No, a few months ago. Oh. One of my favorite songs that I should have learned years ago, but I'm glad I know it now. This is called Crazy by Nas Barkley. Yeah. I love this song. It's a shit. I feel like such a badass when I play it, too. 
You guys still with me out there? Cool. my album too um it's called goodbye even though this is not my last song <laughs> so i want you to think that all right Do you? 
you better keep up if you wanna Never slow down for any fun Cause shit like this makes me wanna run Back to my happy place Just me, myself and I I know baby you feel it too Cause time don't stop for goody two shoes In this life let's take the time And make this more than cyber crime I get a feeling that's so revealing but you're too slow to pick up what I'm not concealing Try to ignore it But then I'm like, fuck it Cause I feel that when you shoot that gun You know exactly what's gonna come If all that I think is what I know Then you'll decide if we go fast or slow And I keep on following If you give me the groove It takes so to make a thing go right A secret afternoon delight Imagining Possibilities, you never know it's true. Here comes that feeling, I'm on the ceiling. But when we lock each other's eyes, it starts so creeping. It starts with our sex, but that ain't my sex. And this is taking way too long to hit the climax of this song. I ain't got time. Time for anyone else Cause I'm my number one I need a little inspiration And I want a helping hand If you can do the job boy Then I'll make it I'm still dumb I don't remember I must surrender To either do this by myself And leave my best friend on a shelf It's hard to be free When you just can't see that your chance is coming gone before the ending of this I ain't got time Go on and tell you what's on your mind You're out of time So goodbye Yeah. How much time do I got? As much as you want. Yeah? Hell yeah, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So uh, I'll do one more cover, because cover's always good. Um, this is another song that you guys probably all know um, and that I've known for forever. It's called um, Sweet Child of Mine. Yeah. But like the jazz singer-songwriter version. skills are definitely not like classically like psh, trained and shit but it's definitely a tool I've used for my songwriting and uh, my voice for sure so thanks for bearing with me y'all
Nick, was that you? <laughs> Screech. That was good. I liked it. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much. Um, all right. Since we're on the love train, I guess I'll play another love song. Yeah. Riding on that love chain. That love chain. That's what you want to do. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, the song I actually didn't write. This is like one of the only songs I didn't write on my album. Um, but my uh, guitar player I used to work with, her name's Elise McCoy. She um, wrote this song, and let me use it for my album. So this goes out to you, Elise. I miss you. Detroit City been through a war And I need a break I can't wait anymore I want to drive towards the Boston shore I wanna hang out with you I wanna make out with you Time has been passing so slow And I'm waiting on autumn to show Leaves will start falling before you know I wanna hang out with you I wanna make out with you
Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> the best. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love you. Um, all right, cool, y'all. This is going to be my last one. Um, I know. I know. I'm going to leave. Um, the song is one of... Oh, okay, so since I have a little bit of time. The album uh, that's out right now, Cold Fame, it's definitely a concept album that ranged from tracks 1 through 14. And it's def- there's definitely a story that um, the songs tell and, like, the vibe of the songs tell. Um, so this is one of the last songs. Um, and I definitely ended up in a lot more of a happier place at the end of writing and, you know, creating the whole album. So this is my, my end song. It's called White Girl Wasted. <laughs> I feel like everyone can relate. Everyone's been white girl wasted at least once in their life. Yes. Everyone. Yes. All right. <laughs> All right, y'all. Thank you. Thank you again so much. Miss Gina Irene Ashudo. Gina Irene and T Money Green. Yes, baby. Boy, you were beautiful. Thank you so much. Simply beautiful, too. 
Wow, where you at, girl? Thank you, you were great, you were beautiful. Hey, look, I would like to thank a couple people right quick, Clap City Records, and then I would like to thank uh, the little blondies for the beautiful sound on the microphones, because you sounded beautiful. And believe the hype about them online, littleblondies.com. At uh, uh, TV1061 in Atlanta, those are all good friends. They all tuned in to hear you. And uh, a very beautiful lady here. And look, do me a favor, stick and stay, don't go away. You got Jackie Wallace with the interview. Miss Gina Irene Asuto. One more time, y'all, let's hear it. All right. Gina, Gina, Irina, shoot it one more time. Woo! You know, crushed it, crushed it. One of the most undeniable Thanks. voices. Thank Unbelievable. you. Unbelievable. And wow. tonight was like stripped down. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I've been performing like that a lot more lately. Oh my God, I it's like, like the, the jazz. That it creates. Yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah. So, Thank okay, you. this is your first time here. Yeah. And what do you think? I think it's the most amazing little jam room I've ever been in. That's awesome. It's so fit cool. perfect. Your set fit perfect. It's so, so cool. I want to I want to ask you obviously what you have going on right now, but before we do that, just so everybody else knows what a little bit of the uh, uh, highlights. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Outlining. I'm not going to go into everything, yeah, but so. on a whim, you decided to audition for Idol. It was yeah. not something you were planning on doing. Does it on a whim? Um, she makes it to the final. She's the runner-up. Yeah, no big deal, right? <laughs> then uh, goes on the Idol tour, 40 cities. Comes home, gets signed to Original 1265 Recordings. Yes. Um, you are also in school for songwriting, I right? Am, At yeah. Dine, mm -hmm. Detroit Institute of Music Education. Which, by the way, we got to do a shout out to them yeah, because for sure. if you haven't heard, Billboard magazine. Uh, <laughs> they says, just yeah yeah they just announced them as the. Um, Top 10 the business yes, the top music, music school. business schools in the country. In the country. Yeah. So right here in the D. So musicians, oh, yeah. you don't have to go anywhere. It's right here. Yeah. So congratulations to Dime. For sure. Um, and then in 2017, you released your first album, like you talked about, did some of the covers or some of the songs mm -hmm. from the album mm -hmm. Cold Fame. Um, and I think you watched that succeed too, because I know some of those songs charted Which, on the billboard. Yeah. 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 Wow. Like so so you've been a little yeah. busy. Yeah, definitely. It's been uh, it's been a lot of groundwork, I would say, um, that I'm putting into not just like my my music, but me as a person too. Because after the whole whirlwind with Idol, um, yeah, it was kind of crazy to like just jump from there and then go back, slap back to reality. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like, um, it took a it took a minute for me to kind of get acclimated again and then do the album. Um, but now I'm in my last trimester of. Uh, my degree. So and what's your degree? My degree is in, uh, I'm getting my bachelor's in creative songwriting. Um, wow. For the online wow. program. Woo! Awesome. Woo! I, have like I have one more class or two more classes, I can't remember. Um, wow. Like 12 weeks left and in the home stretch. So. Okay. And uh, what about um, another album? There's, um, a, there's a rumor going definitely around. Definitely in the works, for sure. Okay. Um, I'm Can in you the tell writing, us anything? In, in, in the writing process right now, but... Um, Pretty much all I can say. That's it. Yeah. Top secret. Yeah. Um, is it? Can you just tell me this? Is it? Uh, are there any similarities to the first album, or is it? For sure. Different. For sure, I would say that um, the new music that I'm kind of creating in my own and with um, the help of my, you know, my new friends that I've um, met with in the last few years. Um, <laughs> It's definitely, there's definitely a lot of live organicness from the first album, but also paired with um, some electronic as well. Ooh. So, Ooh and hip hop nice. and all that good Oh, stuff. really? Yeah, Are you doing sure. any collaborations? Or? Um, uh, there's definitely some in the works as oh, of right now. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, do you have a, an idea of when it might be released? Or? I don't have an idea of uh, when it's going to be released, but definitely um, the songs are almost all already. Really? Mm -hmm. How many songs? There's a lot that I have to like go through. Cut, yeah, cut yeah. out. So. Did you start of... working on this right after the first one was released, or do you take a break and enjoy that success um, and ride that wave a little before you get into it again? Honestly, for me, like writing comes in like such big waves like so sometimes I'll just go like months without even like having an idea that I like that really I can and then like I don't know then I'll just like go live life for a few months and then just like I'll have so inspiration much inspiration comes. yeah exactly mm -hmm. it just it has to come out kind of so thing. Cold Fame that album um was very um Real, very like very super raw, melancholy. Very, it was. It, I mean, you you didn't hold back mm -mm. at all. You really just. I was definitely like trying to be a rebel too, though. Yeah, at the it same came time. through. In the yeah, because after <laughs> after Idol ended, I was like, "This is how I really feel." Yeah, you know? <laughs> this is what. Yeah. I really feel. So, I smoke weed, and I'm not afraid to say yeah. that kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, but what about this? Are you at a different place right now? Yeah, for sure. I've, so how's, like that, I said, how's that going to come out in, in the music? Like, um, how do you think? There's definitely more uh, sophisticated topics, I oh. think. Um, uh, just a lot of just a lot of like trying to actually like figure yourself out and, yeah. and where you, you fit in and all this crazy world. And so. isn't that kind of hard with how much noise there is in the industry? Isn't it hard? For to sure. Just... But I do have to say that there is a whole. Um, vibe about Detroit that I've never felt anywhere else um, and the fact that how much support there is uh, in this okay. city we got yeah. 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 so it's yeah it's definitely like no place I've ever been before and I'm just crazy awesome that and I come from here so it's awesome we're so glad that you do come from here yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, any big tours and what else? There's a few um, local shows that I'm doing over uh, the summer. Um, definitely gonna be hitting up a lot of festivals, not performing, okay. but just going to network and um, oh, okay. kind of figure some stuff out. So. Okay, and how can people find you? You can uh, find me on my website. It's www.ginairene.com, and that takes you to all my um, social media pages and all the new releases and stuff like that. So. All right. Well, thank you for being thank here. Thank you this so is much. Episode 16, I have to ask you one more thing. Yeah. We usually say what's on your bucket list, but now we're going to say what's your dope-ass dream. What's your dope-ass dream? I love that. Yeah. What is it um, for the year? My dope-ass dream for the year? Mm -hmm. Probably to collaborate with as many people as I possibly oh, can. Cool. You know? <laughs> Team Bonnie Green. Team Bonnie oh, Green. Uh -huh. That's right. Yay. Yeah, 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 that's right. right. All right. GMG. All right, well, thank you so much thank for being Thank you so much. Oh, Seriously. Wow. Great. Yeah. All right, give it up one more time. Let's give it up. quickly say thank you to your broken blanket, Nikki, uh, Jay, Kurt, Kurt, I hope I don't forget anyone, um, Tommy, Ahmad, Tommy Josh, Shadow, Justin, and I think I got everybody right today, I got everybody, oh wait a minute, I did not get the boss, don't worry about that. yeah, 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 come on, I'll be fired, we were just talking about who you wanted to fire right now, yeah, so. and of course the face of Hyped Up Live Sessions and the boss, Yes. Uh, award winning, outstanding, and she didn't say the wait. cute face, she outstanding the face. producer of the year, yeah, Mr. T Money Green, yeah, they finally gave it yeah. to me, so, yeah, I want to yeah, thank the studio, studio audience, you guys rock. Yeah. Yeah. And please keep sharing and showcasing the greatest talent in the world because it's right here in the deep. Yeah. So we'll be back July 23rd. We're going to feature one of the hottest Detroit rock bands, Slight Return. You guys are not going to want to miss that yeah, show. Yeah, that's going to be fun. Um, yeah. It is going to be fun. Okay. And until then, yeah. stay hype. Stay yeah. hype. Yeah. Stay dope. Stay dope. <laughs> Tonight's show is sponsored by Strauss and Strauss, Michigan's finest attorneys at law. Ooh Wee Coffee, it's organic. Mike Zolchek, any five, available on iTunes and Spotify. Podcast Detroit, Detroit's finest podcast hub. Herbacare Dispensary, 
8680 8 Mile in Van Dyke. House of Pancakes, the very best in Macomb County. The Digital Vision. Fat Roach Records. And from the makers of Dope Water, what's your dope ass dream? This month's single spotlight, Red Rum Society, How I Cope. Available on all media outlets.